<laughs> so glad that side of Keep it up, boys. Done a great job. <laughs> G'day, how we doing? Um, in Stuart Island here. We've got 10 days in this beautiful hut, staying at uh, North Big Glory. Beauty. Um, bit of diving, bit of fishing and hunting. Pretty excited. Got myself here, Chris. Got Reddy here on the right of me, and Mitch to the left. So, we've made it down to Stuart Island. We are bloody fizzing for this trip. We've been planning it for a while, and it's all come together. I think we're going to go for a quick dive. Um, get some blue cod, get a feed for dinner and maybe go for a hunt later, but yeah, pretty damn excited, eh? Ten days, do whatever we want really, take our time. Sure, yeah, man. Let's do it. Ten days, yeah. let's get into it! Yo! Woo! We'll just give you a really quick tour of the hut. Here we've got the outdoor area. Bench, got all the chili and coal and stuff out here. Inside, right on the entrance we've got a gun rack. Bloody handy. Stack the shelves to the brim. Got food under here, for, food for days. Boys having a wee snack. Ready's brushing up on his knowledge, eh? Yeah, yeah. Bit of local knowledge. What are you learning, mate? I was a few rounds, a few deer being shot. A few good diving, good diving, apparently, so I'm sure we'll be on for a feed tonight. Boys setting up the first dive. How's the excitement level, Sam, man? Through the roof. Through the roof, Mitchie, you excited?
from our dive. Get a shower. See you, man. Some warm water in there. It's beautiful. <laughs> Dried off and warmed up because it was bloody freezing. <laughs> Ready to sit in cat trap. Red, red is local knowledge. We found there's heaps of cats in the area, so we're going to try and clean some of those up. And Chris is filling up blue cod, getting some dinner ready. What's the technique like, buddy? Nah, it's pretty average at the moment. <laughs> pretty average. <laughs> hey, at pretty least you're honest. Out of practice. By the end of the week, we'll be killing it. So we've got about an hour left of daylight, so we're going to go for a, a cheeky wee bush talk. Between me and Brady, we're going to see who gets the first shot. If we see something this evening. Pretty little looking, but it's a white tower, so I couldn't get a shot across here. It's pretty thick in here, though. So. My boys, cheese for dinner. Mm. Yeah. Lovely. Such a good start. Maybe me and Mitch can go into that spur there. See that yeah. little knob there? Yeah. You drop us off there, maybe we you get a little bit there. further down. Yeah, avoid boat round to maybe find a clearing. Papers is right between me and Mitch. So he gets to take the rifle. All on the line here. All right. Paper, scissors, right. Woo! Oh, he's gone smoked. All right, Mitch is on rifle duties. No pressure now. <laughs> <laughs> it rained this morning, boys. <laughs> Talk about service, eh? Ready's a good boatman. So, we've come up into the bush here, and it's pretty open at the moment. We're on a bit of a spur. Um, there's a bit of sign in the forest. So, yeah, this has been grazed back by something. We've seen some fresh boat just back there, too. So, it's a nice little spot. We're going to take it real slow through here, and hopefully, get onto something. Unfortunately, we couldn't get onto any deer, so it's back to the pickup point to wait for Eddie. Well, we're waiting for our water taxi. Reddy's a little bit late, but it's all good. <laughs> it's a nice day to chill out. <laughs> if he shows up soon. Well, it's hard. It's good service these days, oh, eh? I can't know. Imagine the boat's broken down. <laughs> he might be paddling back at the moment. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> he looks like he's in the right, in the right place, eh? Hey? Our taxi has arrived. Here we go, I'm ready. <laughs> you smoke something? What? You smoke anything? Nah. Did you? Fuck. Nah. Did you? Nah, did you? Really? Yeah. Motor broke down. You've been a wet old pedal. What? <laughs> Motor's down. It's motor down. <laughs> oh, shit. Imagine the boat's broken down. Wasn't joking. Uh, motor is fucked. <laughs> <laughs> Stead's a mechanic, runs in the family then, surely. <laughs> oh. Sign of good luck? I think not. <laughs> yeah, try right now. Yeah, here you go, go, go. Sounds so sad. <laughs> so we, we've got about an hour left of light. So we're going to head back over to where we saw that white tail last night and hopefully it's kicking around again and we'll be ready for it. Chris is going to bowl it over. Chris is on the trigger. His white tail, he's got unfinished business with it. Well, that white tail has not shown up. Looks like we've been outsmarted again. It's obviously not that hard. <laughs> um, so for tomorrow, we're thinking we're going to go boat across, most likely paddle, uh, over to the ocean side and look for some parlor, maybe some crayfish. Regardless if that deer pops out or not. Pretty heavy here. <laughs> Should put the fishing rod in the dive gear. Hey, great work, boys. Made it across, sand it most of it, we're here now. So we've just made it to the east coast of the island. We um, carried all our stuff in our packs, all the dive gear. Boys are just gonna suit up now and hopefully get onto some craze and some blue cod. Watching these bays here, nice wee reef out there.
flowers, blue mochi, blue cod, yum. Here you go, mate. Here you go. Oh, look at this for a film job. Nothing left on there, eh? That was a spin. Right, well, the boys are all splitting up for the day. I'm um, gonna spend the whole afternoon up until dark tonight by ourselves. Reedy's gonna hang around this cove here, where we originally saw the first deer. Yep. And then Mitch is going to go pretty much where that cursor is and wait by a what is it? By broadleaf. A broadleaf tree, some feed. Broadleaf tree, and then I'm just gonna carry up the ridge and find some sign and probably wait around, see if anything comes out. Well, Mitch is out here. He's going that way, and I'm going that way. Best luck to you, mate. Cheers, mate. Good luck, eh? Seen. A bit of a sore ass to be honest. Not, not used to this style of hunting, but um, yeah, I'm gonna go now next to the area I was looking at too. And then still the way back to the hut. Probably be home about, about six fish. And then get the fire roaring because she's pretty chilly. <laughs> Hope the fellas did something better than I did today.
Hey, cheers to no deer, boys. Cheers, boys. No deer. Great day. Sausages, got an onion, two carrots, a uh, whole lot of butter, soy sauce, tin tomatoes, and garlic, mushrooms later on, potentially, and maybe some cream. Shit, that sounds bloody good, eh? Sitting off for a hunt. Um, weather's cleared for us a little bit, so. I reckon the deer might be to start moving. Another front's going to be coming soon, so wait most of our weather window and get into it. Reddy was keen to head back to that same clearing in the hope that some fine weather would draw out some animals. Unfortunately, the only movement he found was this oyster catcher feeding in the shallows. I just spooked one about 20 metres away. Seen the white tail flashing around. Today's the day we shoot a deer. Woo! There's no voice. That's you. We got blue cod rapture briggy out for a dive. Shoot some blue cod, start feeling successful. Get the eye in, smack a deer over. Something truly horrific happened this morning. Absolute horror story. What happened? Run out of blue cod. What are we going to do about that? Ease us. Nice hot water, hot soapy <laughs> water. Get into these cold ass wetsuits. Go get some more. Bloody oh. How you feeling boys? Just parked up and the rain started. <laughs> <laughs> we went to a blue sky. Target species today. He aims to be in and out. It's a blue cod. Keep Brett out of the rain for as long as possible. Enough for dinner, yeah. I'm the one battling on board here. Chris, what do you want to shoot today? White tie. A white tie. <laughs> <laughs> there should be Probably a few. The spear gun, there should be a few around. <laughs> Wait, white tail or white pointer? <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> On the board now for Mitchy. Not bad size cod too. Watch your light down there. It's probably just about as weird as it up here. Chris is over there somewhere. He's pissed off his mate's still away from so far. Be man on a mission. Get back in there, Mitchy. Two more, and we're off for a deer. What's that? Two more, then we're off for a deer. Yep.
God and sunshine. About time. Woohoo! There it feeds the boys. Right, so we found a bay to park up here. We're all going to sit off in different directions and look at the different areas. Yep. Been for tea, boys. Good night, mate. Good night, mate. See you later on. Put the kiwi in the wild. First time for us, eh? Yeah. Sorry, Ray. I'll show you the footage. Yeah. Huge ass rain cloud coming, eh, hey, boys? Yeah, I guess. Motors, wait. It's that peddling, eh? Motor's cut out. <laughs> <laughs> Paddle, boys, I think that storm's about to hit. <laughs> That's us for part one. Make sure you tune back in for part two, where we'll have plenty more hunting and diving action, as well as tons of Stuart Island wildlife. Make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss it. Cheers for watching, guys.
just who the gun shot.